Welcome to My Secret Math Tutor. I have an excellent problem here where we will find the composition of two functions. Now, basically the, the notation that's used for this looks something like this. F circle G X. And the way you read this is F of G of X. And it basically means to take one function and put it inside of the other one. Now, if you're looking at that saying, well, which one should go inside of the other one, here's how to tell. The one closest to the x, the g in this case, that is the inside function. And the one further away from x, the f, that is the outside. So one thing I like to do to help keep the outside and inside function straight is actually use an alternate notation for the composition. And that alternate notation looks like this. So I write down f, and inside of it, I put the g. Now, that makes my brain a little bit happier, because I can actually see that g is definitely inside of f. All right. Now, this will also help us uh, figure out what the composition looks like, because now we're going to go through a substitution process to figure that out. OK? So as I start substituting, I'm going to work from the inside out. So the first thing I'm going to substitute is this g of x. So I look back and say, OK, what is g of x? Oh, it's 4x squared. OK, I'll put that in. Done. Looks pretty good. Now that I've substituted out my g, I need to take this and put it inside of my f function. Now to do this, you take what is ever inside of f, and it replaces wherever you see an x. So watch how this works. F is normally the square root of x minus 1. But, but notice how I didn't write that x. That's because I'm going to put the 4x squared in there. There we go. So this expression now represents my composition. This is f of g of x. Now, sometimes you can even take this a little bit further and simplify it. But this particular one, is, it's as simple as it gets. So there you have it. If you'd like to see some more videos, please visit MySecretMathTutor.com.